You know, what's T? Ah, oh, fuck my nose. Somebody put a bowl in my fucking nose. And you know, what's and you know, what's T girl? How y'all doing? Y'all all right? Hmm. Cool. So, any gay girl, before I get started on this video, two things. If you hear a buzzing noise in the background, it's just my diva fan, bitch, because I need to have me a fan blowing on me while I'm doing the video, girl, because a bitch gets frustrated, I get high, all kind of shit be kicking off, girl. This fucking fan keeps me just somewhat sane. The other thing is, as y'all probably already know, I don't even know why I'm fucking telling y'all, but for the bitches that's just coming for the first time that might get scared when they catch a little thigh flash at him and shit, only dress the top half, bitch. I ain't got the time, okay? So, anyho, girl, and I barely did that, bitch, because this ain't nothing but a t-shirt. So, anyho, girl, I got this fucking letter from one of the people who watched my videos. I'm not going to tell her, um, release her name because she wants to be remain anonymous, right? So, she sent me this letter, bitch, and word to my motherfucking fag. Bitch, I have not done an advice video in a long fucking time. But the second I read this shit, bitch, where's my camera, bitch, okay? Because I need to talk to another bitch about this motherfucking situation, bitch. I need to talk to somebody else about what I read, bitch. Because this bitch blew my motherfucking wig back, okay, bitch? You know what I'm saying, bitch? I can't wait to get into this shit, girl. Because I'm going to read this motherfucking letter from cover to cover, bitch, starting now. I would have rather read this shit off my fucking iPad. But for whatever reason... The iCloud is not communicating tonight. The bitch is throwing me nothing but shade. So I'm just going to read it off my iPhone, girl. So she writes, Miss Anonymous. She says, Dear Brian B., I'm in need of advice. I'm a 23-year-old woman. My boyfriend is six years older than me, and we've been together for two months. Okay? The first time I stayed over, something strange happened in the bedroom. I was essing his D. Bitch, are you 23 years old and scared to say sucking his dick, bitch? You was s his D, bitch. You was s his D at 23 years old. Bitch, if you don't suck his dick and shut the fuck up today, I was s his fucking D. I wish the fuck I would s a D. Come, bring that, bring that D over here and let me s it. Will you bring it? Bring the D over here and let me s it. Anyway, I was s his D. His D has a curve in it, but not in the shaft. It's right before the head. I wish this bitch would have sent me a dick pic. Bitch, you can't tell me no shit like that. You can't tell me that the dick has a curve in it, but the curve is not at the motherfucking shaft. It's right before the head. What kind of Tetris dick are you fucking sucking, bitch? Please tell me. How the fuck this shit don't been here, but the motherfucker been up here? So you telling me you fucking with a dick that right at the head is just like, are you serious, bitch? Drop my goddamn iPhone, bitch. I can't be dropping my full girl. I need her to survive, bitch. A bitch is not eligible for upgrade. <laughs> the struggle is real. So, anyhow, girl. Uh, his D has a curve in it, but not the shaft. It's at the head. It's like a hook. So, you can imagine how tricky it is to S his D. Bitch, did you tell me it was tricky to S his D? Now I'm saying the shit. Did you tell me the dick was tricky? It's a tricky dick to suck. Because I already know, bitch, sucking a dick with a curve in it gives you problems, bitch, okay? Sucking a dick with a curve in it gives you problems. See, I'm like a Leah, bitch. I like to go back and forth on the motherfucking dick. That's where I'm at all motherfucking day. I ain't trying to come around the motherfucking corner on the shit and suck this shit like But you ain't even doing that, bitch, because your shit is bent right at the motherfucking head like this shit. So you sucking a dick like this. And S and his D was tricky. Okay, bitch, it was tricky. That shit wasn't easy, bitch. That's not some shit a newcomer come up on. That's a tricky dick, okay? You know what I'm saying? That bitch needed some GPS for that dick. Slight right. Continue to your destination. Slight right. Continue to your destination. Slight right. Continue to your destination. Bitch, that's a tricky dick, girl. I hit that. <laughs> Alright, bitches, stop it, damn it. We gotta finish this motherfucking letter, girl. So back to the letter, girl, right? So she was like, so she says then, um, while I'm s in the D, he pulls my head up and shoves it in his ass and yells, get him! <laughs> it shoves it in his ass and yells, get him! That was the first time. Wait, hold up, bitch. <laughs> the first time. <laughs> that was the first time it happened. Okay, then that morning, I woke up to him squatting over my face, 
sliding his naked behind back and forth over my face. He was forcing me to eat his behind both times. His behind smelled like onion rings. And I like onion rings. But not so much now. Bitch. This bitch is fucking with me. She's fucking with me, right? This is not a real story, girl. This is not a real story. She's got to be fucking with me. Um, I knew you were the person to come to for advice. When this happened, I immediately thought of you and thought of you for help. Wait. What the fuck am I doing on YouTube? What image am I projecting on YouTube when a nigga puts his face in your ass and the first motherfucker you think of is, Hey, where's Brian B? Because this nigga needs to know about this. What the fuck am I doing on YouTube all these motherfucking years? Like, True T, this commode face bitch kind of got me in my feelings. Like, word to my motherfucking fag. She got me in my fucking feelings right now. Like, I'm not trying to come for you, boo-boo, in no way, shape, or form, bitch, okay? Because keep in mind, you're anonymous. So I'm searching for a name for your ass, bitch, okay? And when you got an ass in your face, toilet mug is one of the few things that pop into my motherfucking mind. Can I call you toilet mug? Can I, can I call you dookie cheek? Can I call you dookie cheek? You know, can I call you shit face? You know, can I have a name for you, but can I call you booty face? What can I call you, bitch? You know what I'm saying? So I'm just searching for a name for you. So I don't want you to get up in your motherfucking feelings. But I'm feeling some motherfucking type of way. That when you sit in your motherfucking bed and a nigga hovers over you in the a.m. motherfucking hours and puts his ass in your face, I'm the first thing that pops in your motherfucking head, okay? Because, bitch, true T, the furthest thing from my fucking mind when a nigga puts his ass in my face is some fucking fruitcake on YouTube that yells my bangs bitch for fucking views. The furthest thing from my mind. I'm gonna tell you what's on my mind bitch. This is what's on my mind. I'm gonna punch that motherfucker in his hanging balls, okay? What I'm gonna knock them motherfuckers into his throat. The nigga gonna have three Adam's apples fucking with me, okay? Let me wake up to your ass in my face and I'm gonna grab the closest thing to me. The TV remote is going up into your motherfucking ass. You understand me? I'm a Mike Tyson, your motherfucking rectum. I'm gonna bite that shit and snatch your fucking insides out. I would even settle for, at this point, get your ass out my fucking face. But that's not what happened. That's not what happened. You commenced to eating his ass out when you woke up to his ass in your face. You commenced to... Well, I guess I got to eat an ass out this morning. <laughs> Who the fuck does that, okay? I wake up to an alarm clock to the motherfucking sun coming through the blinds, bitch, or bacon frying in the goddamn kitchen. I wish the fuck I would wake up to a nigga's ass hovering in my motherfucking face. Not even hovering in my face. This shit is sliding across my face like this shit here. What the fuck? I wish. Bitch, I wish. Onion ring ass at that. The bitch said his ass smell like onion ring. The bitch gonna tell me I like onion rings though, but not so much now. This bitch fucking retarded. The bitch is remedial, is she? Bitch, you need to start sleeping with a toothpick in your mouth, bitch. You need to do this shit right here. Just put a toothpick in your mouth, bitch, and go to sleep just like this. Cause when that nigga come to have a seat, that motherfucker gonna go quick, quick, and that motherfucker gonna jump up like ah, on some goofy shit. Yes, yeah, on. Okay, little Miss Brown Nose. So here's my advice. So listen to him, bitch, as I read. First of all, bitch, you're gullible. You're gullible. You're a gullible ass, bitch. Yes, God, bitch, you are so fucking gullible. Anybody who wakes up to someone else's ass in their face and commences to not saying, motherfucker, get your ass out my face or swinging, says, I'm going to eat this motherfucking ass out. No, 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 no. You're a gullible bitch, okay? And I'm using the word gullible because I want to be nice to you, bitch, okay? I want to be nice to you because you watched my videos. You took time out your motherfucking gay to write me this motherfucking letter. I want to be nice to the fucking you, bitch. So I'm going to call you a gullible ass bitch, okay? Number two, the nigga that you fucking with, he's testing the waters, okay? He's testing the waters to see how far he can go, okay? Because this is a nigga who enjoys anal pleasure, okay? He He's either exploring... Or he already knows what he likes. And being that you told me he's, what, six years older than you and you're 23, which makes him, what, 26, 30? This motherfucker already knows what he likes, okay? And that tongue, bitch, is only scratching the motherfucking surface. It's only 
scratching the motherfucking surface, girl. Because the G spot is a lot deeper than that, bitch. Trust and believe. So eventually it's going to lead to toys. Or this nigga going to find him one of them DL hookups. Or he going to try to bring another nigga into the bedroom with you with a threesome. And you's a gullible ass bitch. And I'm pretty sure you going to be with that, bitch. So I'm going to tell you right now, now, bitch. If you sending me this message because you're not liking that whole sexual experience, bitch. You fell for it. You did it. But then the next gay you woke up and you wasn't feeling right about your motherfucking self, bitch. Then you need to move on about your fucking way. Because this man gets pleasure through his anus. And he going to need you to either strap on and lick up. Or shut the fuck up and go on about your motherfucking gay. That ass, bitch. That's my advice to you. Either strap on and fuck the shit out of his ass and lick his ass from the rooter to the fucking tutor. Or let that shit go. And that's my advice to you. Fuck. Double snap up and go. Hmm.